Hello everyone, today I want to show you a very useful trick to pull data from the internet and put it into an, ex an Excel uh, workbook. Let's say you're online and you're, you're doing research and you come across a table or uh, some other information that you'd like to, to put into an Excel. Obviously you can try and copy and paste the information. It might not always work out as you'd like. Formatting can come out very ugly, but there is another way that you can go about doing this and it will be very easy and, and save a lot of time. So what we wanna do is we want to go to, so for example here, I've got my table of World Cup winners through history. And let's say I wanna put this in, ex, in an Excel spreadsheet. And so what I'll do is I'll go to my Excel book, a workbook here, and go to data. So I'll want to click on the data tab. We're going to scroll over to the left and you'll see there's a couple different options to get uh, data from online. What we want is from web. So we're going to click on from web and it'll take it just a minute, but it's going to open up. It's going to prompt a pop-up window that's going to ask for a URL. So we're going to keep this easy today, or we'll leave it on basic but we just need the URL of the data table that we want to reference. So we'll go ahead and just drop that in there and then hit OK. It will take a minute. It's going to check. It's going to connect with the site, make sure everything's OK. So now it's going to give us, uh, it could say many things on the right side, but for us, it's saying that no, there's nothing to display. But if you look on the left side, there's a couple different tables that it's pulled. So you can look through this information to see if this has the table that we're looking for. So this is what we want right here is the list of finals of the FIFA World Cup. So we can go ahead and, and take a look at that. And that is exactly, you know, the information that we were looking for. So all we'll have to do now that that's selected is we will hit load. And it's going to go ahead and again and, and ask some query connections. And then it's going to dump that data for us right here in uh, our spreadsheet. So now we have that information. So again, a super easy way to get that information off the internet, make sure it's nice and formatted correctly, and it's going to give us to us in this table format. So something that can help us uh, save a lot of time and a lot of headache as we're trying to pull data again off the off the internet. So I hope this is helpful. Let me know if you have any more questions uh, around this function. I'd be happy to answer any more questions. And uh, please remember to subscribe to the Excel guy. Thanks and have a great day.